uh, as we know that this press briefing is about a very important event not only at our ut level not at national level uh, but at the international level uh, we very proudly say that our university uh, university of kashmir has been chosen amongst the 15 universities of the country uh, to organize this youth 20 consultation uh, which is one of the very important mandate for our G20 presidency, uh, which our country was given uh, in uh, December 2022. Uh, at the outset, I am so grateful to all the print and electronic media for being with us this afternoon. And I am also uh, very grateful uh, from uh, the university point of view to all the officials who are here with us from Press Information Bureau. Uh, this press conference has been organized to update our press about the activity that will be held here on uh, 11th of uh, May. Uh, before I talk, uh, you know, uh, briefly about it, I must, uh, uh, we, uh, the University of Kashmir is very thankful to our Honorable Prime Minister, uh, Shri Narendra Modi ji, for uh, giving us this opportunity to host this particular program. We are also very thankful to Honorable Minister of Sports and Youth Affairs, Government of India, Shri Anurag uh, Thakurji, and of course, to our Chancellor, uh, Chancellor and uh, Lieutenant Governor of JNKUT, Shri Manoj uh, Senaji, for uh, you know, lending all uh, help to us uh, in organizing this very important event of international, uh, you know, concern. Now, uh, the theme for this uh, particular event will be on climate change, uh, uh, climate change, uh, uh, disaster, uh, uh, disaster risk uh, reduction, and uh, way of, uh, you know, sustainability development. Uh, very important themes will be touched. These themes are impact of climate change on biodiversity and human well-being, disaster risk reduction for safe tomorrow, green energy innovations and opportunities, water resources, challenges and prospects. Uh, while you must be seeing these themes, uh, the concern must be why University of Kashmir has chosen these themes uh, with great, uh, you know, uh, with great satisfaction and with great pride. I say that University of Kashmir has got uh, the expertise on uh, climate change, uh, you know, any uh, research topic on climate change and we'll be happy to know that we have a center uh, for excellence on uh, glacial studies uh, uh, in our, uh, you know, university, which is funded by uh, Department of Science and Technology, Government of India. Uh, and uh, if you see the uh, articles, research articles, not only at national but also at the international level, uh, our, uh, you know, articles, whether it's of research scholars or of the faculty, figure in very reputed international uh, journals. That shows the expertise which we have uh, in this particular field. I'm happy to share with you that for this event, you know, whole teaching, non-teaching faculty, especially students, research scholars have been engaged for organizing this particular program. Youth is very important stakeholder in this particular theme and the recommendations which will uh, go on for policy implications, it will definitely come the, from the forum of youth. Uh, we have tried to engage youth even from the school level, even from college level and also from the uh, university level, which will engage in question answer uh, sessions about the panelists, I say. We have very uh, well known panelists from uh, G20 countries, also panelists from our own uh, country uh, and, uh, you know, uh, very uh, experienced moderators who will be moderating the uh, sessions. And throughout, uh, since it's on, uh, the major event is on 11th, uh, you know, May itself, and whole day, uh, all our youth will be engaged in this particular uh, event. 
And I say that it's a very important event for the university and uh, it gives, an, gives us chance to show our academic acumen, to show our infrastructure to the world and to show uh, the development of higher education in our UT uh, to whole of the uh, you know, uh, international world, how University of Kashmir has figured at the international map mapping uh, academic wise and the uh, you know, uh, research wise. So uh, you know, uh, I feel that it's a very important event and for that uh, you know, uh, the type of cooperation we have had from the administration, from the other, uh, you know, stay, uh, from the other uh, UT, uh, you know, wherever we need to have any type of uh, cooperation, we, everyone has cooperated. And uh, we do look forward to have good recommendations from a youth, to have good question answer sessions from a youth, from our youth, so that uh, the, uh, the real motive of this particular program is achieved. Uh, so the, with these words, uh, you know, uh, these, this was, uh, you know, some uh, little briefing that I wanted to uh, give the press about this particular event. Any questions, please? Any uh, questions pertaining to the uh, program, please? Uh, it should be restricted to the program. If there are any queries, uh, you know, we are here to answer that. Yes, uh, you know, that will be given, uh, you know, uh, some of the countries will be participating, not all P20 countries, but some of them are participating. Uh, we have total number of international delegates are uh, 17, and uh, we also have, uh, you know, nine uh, participants of international delegates. Russia are four, Indonesia are four, Mexico is one, Turkey one, Japan one. South Korea 1, Nigeria 1, USA 2, Brazil 2. Uh, you know, uh, those who could be facilitated with the visa, uh, these are all, uh, you know, coming uh, to University of Kashmir. And uh, I'm hopeful that we have very good, uh, you know, interaction with them. And the main thing is uh, we need very good recommendations so that we can preserve our uh, climate. Uh, we can, uh, you know, reduce the material. Uh, you know, all the, uh, uh, you know, uh, all the, uh, I must say that man-made disaster that we are doing to our uh, climate, I, uh, I hope that we reduce that and uh, I do look forward that uh, my main aim is uh, I want that our youth should participate in it. Any other question? They are all, we have even universities from Jammu, we have Ladakh University and we have all uh, sister concerned universities of our valley. Uh, you know, the vice chancellor are participating, their students are participating, their faculty is participating. Uh, you know, uh, since the audiences, we don't have that huge capacity in our convocation complex. Of course, uh, you know, from the management, persons are uh, participating, but not ignore students. Uh, uh, you know, the recommendations will go down the line and it will be beneficial for them also. Any other question? Pardon? Ha, we had sent a letter to the director of school education. They have sent us the list. We had sent a letter to director colleges. She has sent a list. We had sent a letter to the respective vice chancellors of the universities, and they have sent us the list. And uh, we have good number of NSS volunteers who are very much involved in these types of activities. Around 50 NSS volunteers from different colleges affiliated to our university will be participating. Uh, students now, school students are around 75 of them. College is huge number, koi dead so ke kareeb hai. Phir hamare apne, you know, from our own uh, university, we have our students. Ma'am, uh, are you planning a session or is there a session slotted for 
Of course. Especially the few projects that have been developed across in Panama uh, in Pangam. Do we have a session project for that? Of course, it will come up in these, you know, our concerns are local concerns, our concerns pertaining to UT, because that's why we have chosen this particular theme. It will come up in that. It has to. Uh, and lastly, uh, you know, we definitely uh, need your active support in covering this event. Uh, this event is very important for our youth. Our youth can get chance to, uh, you know, uh, move forward in their research, in their academics. They can approach different universities internationally to get, uh, you know, admission when you uh, showcase the acumen and the intelligence of our youth. Definitely, uh, you know, they can get a chance uh, to get admission in different uh, you know, world-class uh, universities because they have those capacities, they have those intelligence. Uh, that's why this particular program has been uh, selected by University of Kashmir, Y20, keeping in view that youth will be involved in it. Thank you very much. I am once again grateful to all. Please join us on the side. Thank you so much.